books uh, on the road. Um, a lot of my teammates have donated magazines. I see Max and Jerome sitting next to her. They uh, gave me some magazines to use, Coach Cure. Uh, all of our coaches, uh, Coach Montgomery, Coach Jay John, uh, Coach G, I, I just have to thank everyone. Um, I don't want to miss anyone. I, I didn't want to write anything because I pretty much freestyled everything I've done. I haven't really put much thought into it. I just let it come to me spiritually. Uh, this has definitely been, oh, I'm sorry. I would also like to thank all the faculty and all the staff at UC Berkeley, all the people in your relations who have helped me make this a reality. Uh, I would like to thank Malcolm X Elementary uh, for giving me the opportunity to, to donate to them. And I would like to thank all of you who have already donated and all of you who will donate. <laughs> Just to give you a brief history of how this has all come about, uh, it all started. Uh, the first young lady who you saw seeing, um, Monique Barber, after a phone conversation we had, she uh, suggested as a New Year's resolution I should start drawing again. It's been uh, three years since the last time I, I drew anything. And after a conversation with her, I went to the local Royal Greens right down the street, uh, and I picked up a sketchbook, uh, color pencils, and uh, some number two pencils and some markers, and I started this whole journey. Um, I drew the first picture in the airport uh, when we were traveling in Washington, and I felt this spiritual connection with the piece that I drew of the president. I felt I wanted to do it more and more and more, and I felt that I was going to meet him. That was just the, the feeling that I had, was that after drawing him, somehow, some way, I'm going to meet him. I don't know if it's going to be through my heart or whatever it is. Uh, but a lot of what has happened hasn't been me forcing it, it's just me putting that positive energy out into the universe and, and watching it come back. 